Latter Levison the FBI secret warrant to surveil Carter Page should scare all Americans and spur reform. A secret, non-adversarial system of judicial review is an insufficient check to our intelligence agencies and law enforcement. As technology makes state scrutiny increasingly easy, America has seen a corresponding increase in the abuse of its surveillance tools. With a legal framework, first created in the 1970s before the widespread use of computers, email, or cell phones the few safeguards we have are evaporating rapidly. The curious case of Carter Page, where the FBI used a foreign intelligence surveillance court warrant to surveil the virtually unknown, unpaid foreign policy advisor to the Trump campaign, is only the latest example of a larger, existential threat to the American system of political discourse. When a physical search occurs in accordance with American criminal law, law enforcement must show probable cause and obtain permission from a judge, and then present a given suspect with a warrant, and a receipt for the items removed. When law enforcement wants to obtain a criminal wiretap, they similarly have to show probable cause to obtain a warrant, carefully collect information related to potential crimes, and then disclose that information if charges are wrought. The key difference, is that with the latter, the suspect will only discover they've had their privacy violated after they've been indicted. With the FISC warrant, it's possible a suspect will never find out, even if charges are eventually filed. In the case of Carter Page, his private life was monitored, for almost a year, without his knowledge, and then placed on display for strangers at the FBI to peruse, all based on a suspicion that he was colluding with Russia. On the basis of hearsay, business associations, and possibly Page's political opinions, the FBI received a classified surveillance warrant and then renewed it three times. And yet, Page was never officially charged suggesting that, even given the ability to surveil him in ways that might make the general public cringe, the FBI was never able to find enough evidence for a single crime. It's clear that a secret process, and a complacent judiciary which has elevated prosecutors and members of law enforcement onto a dangerous perch, provides no safety. It has become clear that a secret, non-adversarial system of judicial review is an insufficient check to our intelligence agencies and law enforcement. When expressed disagreement on a foreign policy issue namely the current sanctions against Russia form even part of the basis of an allegation which meets the bar for a probable causal 